Hey guys, I wanted to make this quick video for you guys because uh, you know, every time I come to Destin, Florida, I have a beach house over here. We, I've been coming here since I was, shit, I've been coming here since I was five, six years old, right? And I've walked these beaches for probably the past, I don't know, uh, what, 30 years I've been walking these beaches? And every time I come, I walk the beach and I visualize. And I would do it unconsciously, not even knowing what I was doing, visualizing my life and what I wanted to do. And how I wanted my life to turn out. And I always told myself, I always told myself I would have a house somewhere right here. For years, I would tell myself, hey, I'm gonna have a, I'm gonna have a beach house one day. And unbeknownst to me, I didn't realize that, you know, 20 something, 20 years later, 25 years later, that, that dream would come true, right? 27 years later right this is why you should walk the beach when you come and and really get it get a, a view like this right and just come think about what you want think about what you want visualize yourself having it even though it may be uncomfortable because you think you're so far off you think there's no way i can have that if you think that man there's no way that somebody like me is ever going to have that guys i'm not i'm not talented i'm i'm not even I'm not even really that good at, at a whole lot of things, but what I am good at is working hard. I'll, I'll work, I'll work to spot everybody I know. And I'm here to tell you that you can have what you want, guys. You see that, that house right there, that new construction house? Right behind it is my house. It's not on the beach, but hey, it's pretty damn close. It's across the street from the beach. Never in a million years would I have ever, ever thought that I would better do that. Never, never. So I'm here to tell you, when you come to the beach, think about what you want. Think about, think about thinking, right? Visualize what you want. Walk the beach. Tell the universe what you want and believe it. Write your goals down. That was, this has been on my vision board for 10 years, guys. This has been on my vision board for at least 10 years. We, me and my wife wrote down, we're gonna have a place in Destin, Florida one day. And not only do I have one, place and, and on the beach I have two. I have, I have another condo in Orange Beach, Alabama. Never in a million years I'd ever thought that I'd better do this. But I always visualize it, put it on paper, put it on my vision board. And we would always ride around and look at it. We'd always ride around and look at property, even though at the time I couldn't afford it, right? And that's how I've lived my life, guys. And that's how I've gotten just about everything that I've put on paper, put on paper and visualize and, and spoke into the universe. Somehow or another, I got it. It might have taken 10 years, 15 years, 20 years, but I've gotten it. I told myself I wanted a lot of kids when I was a little boy. <laughs> I have five children now. I told myself I want to be an entrepreneur when I was like 14 years old. I've owned a dozen companies by the time I was, you know, 38 years old. Now, I don't own all, you know, not all of them are successful, but most of them were. And I've had a few of them that really tanked, but that's, that's, that's part of being in business, right? But the, the more of the story is, guys, and the point I'm trying to come across is when you get when you get to come in a beautifully aesthetic place like this, right? Look at that sun going, going down. Come out here, walk the beach, visualize what you want, put it on paper, work hard at it every single day. Do the hard work, even if you're not that talented. You're probably thinking, Chris, I'm not talented. Nobody, nobody thinks I can amount to shit. Nobody thinks I'm good at anything. My dad thinks I'm, you know, nobody. Listen. It don't matter. None of that shit matters. Because all that shit's been told to me too. I'm here to tell you, you can do it. If, if I can do it, you can do it. And I'm not saying that, that you know I am where I want to be. I'm, I've got, I'm writing down new goals, right? I'm writing down bigger and badder goals that are going to help me get to the next level. And it's going to require a, an astronomical, tremendous amount of effort and work on your part. I'm not sitting here telling you that you're going to write your goals down and walk the beach and say, hey, it's all going to be hunky-dory and everything's just going to magically happen. That's not what I'm here to tell you. I'm here to tell you, put it there, put it on paper, visualize it, experience it, get around it, get around all these beautiful houses, go walk a sunset like that. Look at that. I can't help you see the sun going up. Get around stuff like that and psych yourself out and do the hard work. Do, do what other people aren't willing to do, guys. That's what... If you're not very talented, then your secret weapon should be your work ethic. Your secret weapon should be your work ethic because that's been my secret weapon. I've outworked everybody. I haven't been the smartest. I haven't been the most talented, but I've always had the biggest and best work ethic. So I hope this message really resonates with you. Listen, when I was 
when I was six, seven years old, I was told I was slow, I was no good, I was uh, too hyper, I, uh, I needed medicine. They put me on Ritalin and Adderall at like six years old, turned me into a zombie. I was told I was slow in school, got held back and failed twice. I, I was 19 years old when I graduated high school, guys. 19 years old. You know, I didn't, I didn't live the perfect, <laughs> the perfect life by any means. Um, you know, I got a girl pregnant, my wife now, when I was a, a senior in high school. My first day of my senior year, I had a, my, my son, my first son was born. So I didn't do everything right. I, I, I'm here, to, I, didn't do any, I didn't do a lot of stuff right. But what I'm here to tell you is, you don't have to do it all right. You just gotta keep pushing along and pushing forward and doing the right thing and holding on to that dream. Holding on to that, that idea that you can be somebody one day. As long as you have an insane work ethic. I'm here. It's not all about the dreams. It's not all about the vision board. It is to a certain degree. Half of it, half the battle is putting it in, in your mind and psyching yourself out and telling yourself you can do it. And what will happen is the universe will put it in your way. The universe will, will put it in your proximity and it's going gonna, it's gonna to want you to go grab it. And it's going gonna, it's gonna to require you to do the work. But 50% of it's going to be mental visualization, putting on paper, writing your goals, vision boards, getting in close proximity to your dreams and goals, and then the other 50% is an insane, insane work ethic, guys. So, hope this video finds you well. I'm here at my beach house in Destin, Florida. We have a two-day mastermind in a week. I've got a, one of my buddies that are coming to meet me. One of the speakers is going to hang out with him and his family for a week at my beach house over here, right behind that new construction house. And, uh, if you can make it next year, or actually I'll have, I, I do these two or three times a year, so it's called Potential Mastermind, how to live up to your fullest potential, right? Make sure you get to this, this mastermind next year, right? I'll be posting on social media when the next one is. It'll probably be uh, March of next year. So, and guys, listen, if you're interested in my coaching, if you wanna learn how to be a professional real estate investor, look, I own mobile home parks, short-term vacation rentals like the one behind me. I own a bunch of single family homes, small apartments. I do wholesaling and, and right now we're wholesaling in four different states and five different markets. Making hundreds of thousands of dollars every single month, millions of dollars a year. I can help you. Go to chrisroot.com, book a call with my team. And look, even if you can't afford my coaching, grab my book, the source of the deal. Go to the source of the deal.com and grab my book and try to do it yourself. And I've got enough videos on YouTube to learn how to wholesale on your own to get started. So I appreciate you following me. Look, hit the like button, hit the subscribe, share this video with somebody who needs to hear this. And get on a beach and visualize what you want and go do the hard work.